What is up guys? My name is Fearless Gaming 27, but you already know that. And today we're back with another Walking Dead Let's Play. It's been a while, guys. <laughs> it's been quite some time since I uploaded my last video, and I apologize for that. There really is no excuse. I have just sort of forgotten. I know <laughs> it sounds lame, but there's just been a lot going on and I've just sort of it hasn't been my number one priority. That's what I should have said. I haven't forgotten. I wouldn't forget about you guys. It just hasn't been my number one priority recently to upload YouTube videos. But, um, I'm back. And we're gonna play some Walking Dead. So let's go. Let's do this. Alright. So when we left off, I believe we had... I think we were still in the supermarket, or mini mart, or whatever, and, oh yeah, a woman had just killed herself, I remember that, uh, cause she was about to turn into a zombie, and so I was like, oh no, don't kill yourself, no, and then she Everyone alright? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine, and, well yeah, we're okay. Alright. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Yep. Alright, yeah, 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 I remember that. Uh, we had to get those pills from the pharmacy because that old guy, he blew a muscle. He strained his little heart. Alright. So, okay, so we gotta go get the pills, right? Where, how can we get into the pharmacy? I'm sure we can easily get into a pharmacy. I mean, it can't be that hard. Um, yeah, I think I'm, I've already been in here. Door to pharmacy. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, the axe. We got the axe. I remember now. Oh, that didn't even... Are you kidding me? A freaking axe is not going to be able to destroy a freaking door. It's no. not. No. We need to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. Why can't we just use a freaking axe? You have a fire axe! Just hit it harder! Yeah, it was worth a shot. Keys it is, I guess. Gosh, dang it. Well, we're gonna have to find the keys. The first aid kit. Did I already look at this? I think I did. Oh yeah, I fixed up a... Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Ooh. Alright. So I think we're done in here. Uh, can, let's find them keys. Let's find those keys. So that's the door to the pharmacy. I'm guessing that's where we enter it, and we just gotta find some keys. So, uh, what's this? It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. Ah. Uh, all right. So I gave her a chocolate bar. Fixes everything, right? If someone's ever mad at you. Just give him a chocolate bar. Just give him an old candy. The old, uh, the old candy bar. How you doing, Glenn? You know. Back at the motor inn. What's your story, Glenn? What's your next move? Back at the motor inn. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess. That's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Good, man. Good. Yeah, good. You let her do it, you know. You said give her the gun. I know I did. Why the hell would you do that? Mercy, man. I couldn't let her go on like that. We couldn't. You never know. You can't give up hope. I think it was over for her, Glenn. What's your story, What's your story, boy? Glenn? I deliver pizzas around here. I brought a couple to the Everts a few times. Stoops? Sorry. I mean, the folks that own this place, just really good people. It sucks seeing this place like this. Isn't that the truth? Yep. Yeah. What's your next move, What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Alright. Try to get some rest. Huh. <laughs> yeah, right. 
Want a candy bar? Here. I found some snacks. I'm cool. Not much of an appetite. Maybe save it for one of the kids? Hey, you're not yourself, man. You need the Snickers. You need the Snickers. Alright, I'll give Clementine a chocolate bar. <laughs> that sounded so Everything wrong. Okay? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> oh gosh. Alright, here you go. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Alright. That was horrible. <laughs> okay, food box. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Dude, it's sort of scary because of like all the stuff going on, like Ebola. I mean, I don't think Ebola patients are going to be turning into zombies anytime soon, but it's still sort of, it's a little bit, a little bit creepy. Newspaper. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Oh yeah, didn't I get the batteries? Or did I not? I found this remote in the office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. It needs the big stumpy ones. Yeah, these are no good. Thanks for the description. <laughs> the big stumpy ones. Here's Here, a chocolate bar. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. I already gave her a chocolate bar, man. Get off my, get off my bag, dang. What else? Let me see. Let me try and talk to her. Hey there. Story of the century here, huh? I'm looking for batteries for your radio. All right. Story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts. You do radio. That's right. Well, until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding, and I hit the blogosphere. Ooh. That guy saved you? Yeah, can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Damn. Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that Ooh. parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, uh, nothing. Whoa. What? <laughs> what? How'd you end up How'd here? you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Thanks. I appreciate it. Alright. better get back to it. Yeah, you yep. don't need to tell her that. You can just... Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Stop continuing just remember this what I awkward said. conversation. Yeah, I will. <laughs> that lasted way too long. So, uh, basement boy, how's it going? Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? What? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Huh. Huh. Sounds like a trap. Let's have a look around. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring him back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. I think this guy's been playing too much dungeons, dungeon games. <laughs> Jesus. Ooh. Look at all those zombies, man. So many. I mean, you totally count at one. You totally can't outrun them or anything. I mean, seriously. You can't even outwalk them. They're, I mean, they're so fast. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. They mean, it's not that. Gets you. They eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Yeah, that's it. How the fuck? Ooh! I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. A couple yeah. days? <laughs> You're wrong, pal! We better You're wrong. Keep it down out of here. Alright. Ooh. Open lock. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. It's, ooh. Axe! Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Dang it. Alright. 
That place is full of TVs and electronics. Full of TVs and electronics. Remote control! Activate! Think you can do anything with this? No, I could do. What's that? Throw it at the zombies? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Ooh. Let's just hope the power's still on. You can just do that? Told you, man. He all the codes spends the too AD. much time in that basement. Let's try. Oh, magic! Well, fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? All right. Oh, TV. <laughs> oh, I'm on TV. So what do I got? Let's see what's over there. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. Then what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. <gasps> no! No! Alright, I'll see. It's over there. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Oh, man. Let's go on, trapped over there. <laughs> That's going, bro. <laughs> Better than us. Huh? E every dang, you got some pretty good vision. Oh shit! <laughs> what? Do you see you know the that name guy? on an ID card? He could be a drugstore employee. He could be a drugstore. Wait, employee. hold on. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? Saying he might have the pharmacy keys. Wait, wait, hold on. Wasn't the main character's? Could be anybody, you know. Is his last name Every? Cheek up. And... Shut up, dog. Shoot. And didn't his family own this pharmacy? Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough. Go out there and see if he has the keys. They're freaking slow as heck. Just get out there. You can literally walk to his it. body, get the keys, I'll and then walk back. Alright. Oh, guy over there has the keys. Oh no. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. It is Lee's brother. That boy in the photo worked here. <laughs> the keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. No. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Dang. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Dang. That sucks. Alright, so what are we gonna do? Maybe Open this is sesame. That won't work. <laughs> I was kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doc. Gosh. Uh... Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. <laughs> We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Alright, well, it looks like we're gonna have to use the good old axe. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Now to distract those things. All right. Carefully. Let's go, let's go. Alright, here we go, here we go. Throw the brick. Maybe yes at the window. Make a loud noise. Don't miss though. Better throw that brick. Oh, bam! Throw the brick, yeah! 
Oh, 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 TVs, we're gonna go steal some TVs, bro. Gonna get that nice flat inch. Oh, yeah. Now's the time. That nice 14 inch curved TV. Cur I mean, those were curved TVs before Samsung made it a thing. Alright. Run! Be Run. careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Hurry up. Oh no. Dang. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to Mom and Dad, but I know if you were there, you want to die for them. So, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Sweet brotherly conversations. Give me a second. Zombie brother. Holy crap. I got an achievement at least. Yay. My gosh. There we go. Well, we got the keys. Holy crap! Run! <laughs> nice lookout, bro. Oh no, we're gonna walk so slowly. Oh no. Oh no. How can I ever out. Oh, look at that. I'm already inside. Got the keys. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. Yeah, we did it. All right. I've got the keys. Great. God, yes. you're amazing. Let's get in there. I know. I know. I'm amazing. <laughs> That's right. Okay. Pharmacy. Yo. Open sesame. Too bad that universal remote didn't open this. Oh no. Of course. Shit. We gotta hurry. Why would the freaking alarm go off when you have the key? Aw, oh, isn't this just great? Isn't this just great? Hello there, sexy. You got a screwdriver in your back. <laughs> <laughs> what? Hey, she got screwed. Oh, <laughs> get it, get it. <laughs> All right. Up to seventy percent off at the furniture outlet. Oh boy. Oh, no. Drugs. Never do drugs, man. Never do drugs. Or the zombie. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back. Do it fast! I gotta get my dad out of here! I don't plan Teamwork. on dilly-dallying! Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me! Yeah. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here! You got it! Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then! And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck! Here you go! I that yeah. door's not locked anymore! Here Shit. we go! You three, get on it! Teamwork! As fast as I can! Gotta kill the zombies! Stay away from the windows. Am I supposed to do again? Okay. Hey, Lee. We don't make it through this. 
you should know that I think you're a great guy. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Doug. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. You know what? I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Doug or Carly, man, forget Doug, he's a nerd. Sorry, Doug. <laughs> I feel bad right now. <laughs> well, I wouldn't feel bad if the girl died too, so. Man, this game forces you to make some tough decisions. Oh my god. Let's go! This game makes you. Makes it tough to see. Ah! Oh shoot! Hey. Oh screwdriver lady! Yeah, that's right. Get nailed! <laughs> All right. Man, the fun is here. What? What happened? Oh man, my fingers. Oh I'll my gosh, I could have sworn he was just about to axe me. Especially a good friend. Shoot, man, close the door, what are you doing? Holy crap. Hold on, was Doug that guy's son? Is that why? Is that why he punched me? Yeah, that'd be a good reason to punch someone. <laughs> that'd be a good reason to punch someone. Well, it wasn't really my fault. I mean, it was either one or the other. And after the apocalypse, we gotta repopulate the world. I'm just saying. I'd rather save the girl. Alright. Dude, Clementine's gonna be like scarred <laughs> for a life. Ooh, go get her, duck. Dang, man. Oh, I feel bad for Lee, his brother, man. I wonder if his parents are still alive. Gunshots ringing out like a bell. Man, this is um, freaking. Hey, Glenn. Screwed up stuff. In all counties, Georgia cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage nine catastrophe. Augusta, stage I think I need to go. So it left. Yeah, I got friends there. And I just can't yeah, like stay Britain. here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Glenn! That angry face. You gotta do what you gotta, you gotta do. do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. And then, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. If they go from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? 
You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. See you around, bud. Go find Rick. It's a good group you got there. I can foresee the future. You will find Rick in Hershel. And you will make the sweet babies with Maggie. And you'll find Daryl. One of the coolest characters in the show. Are you guys excited for the new season? If you guys watch the show, I mean, it's gonna be pretty exciting, I think. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We yeah. have to take care of each other. Yeah, yeah brother. We do. Yeah, hey, brother. about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are gonna be just fine. Thanks, Thanks brother. You got it. All right. Dang. All right, so that concludes another episode. If you guys enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like and a comment. And if you guys want to join the circle of fearless gamers, click that subscribe button. My name is Fearless Gaming 27. One more thing before I go. That was a tough decision earlier. I had to choose between Doug or Carla. I think that's her name. And uh, let's just hope I made the right decision. This has been me, Fearless Gaming 27, and I am out. I guess it doesn't matter. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Alright, so I accidentally walked into a cutscene, like, after I stopped recording, and basically, I was just like, you alright, Carla? And then she was like, yeah, I think so, and then she was like, I think I sort of like that guy, Doug, but, uh, we couldn't have saved him, stuff like that, and then, like, how'd you choose between me and Doug, and I was trying to start the recording button, so I, I couldn't really answer that, I just went with, I didn't choose, so... Like, basically, it just sort of happened. Um, so, yeah, that's basically what you guys missed. I didn't really mean to walk into that cutscene without you guys seeing it. But, yeah, that's basically what happened. And once again, see you later.